In this video, we will try to solve a problem that was asked in JM Economics paper of 2021. The question is like this. FRM has two manufacturing plants, one and two, to produce same product, okay? The total cost of production are given by, that means TC1, total cost in plant 1 is 500 plus uh, 30Q1, and total cost in plant 2 is being given by 1500 uh, plus 20Q2. In plant 1 and plant 2 respectively where Q1 and Q2 are the respective quantities, the demand for the product is given by this very equation, okay, where P is the price per unit, we have to find the value of Q1 that maximizes profit of the firm, okay, so the answer should be an integer one. Now, what uh, what is the total cost in, let me write it here. This is the total cost in plant 1, okay? Then what is the, let me write for plant 1, what is then marginal cost? Marginal cost is the derivative of this total cost with respect to quantity, that means D, C, let, uh, let me write it like this, derivative of total cost in plant 1 with respect to quantity, okay, Q1. Now what is the derivative of constant it is 0 derivative of q1 here is 1 so we are left with 30 only okay that means marginal cost in plant 1 is 30 what is marginal cost in plant 2 let me write this like this for plant 2 marginal cost same thing we have to take the derivative of this very function total cost function that is t c2 with respect to q2 okay let me write here q2 Okay, and to see the marginal cost, the derivative of 1500, which is constant, is 0. Derivative of Q2 is 1, so we are left with 20. Okay, so 30 is the marginal cost in plant 1, 20 is the marginal cost in plant 2. And here we can see marginal costs are constant but different. Okay, uh, if marginal costs are constant but different in each plant, production should take place only in the plant with lowest marginal cost. Okay. That means production should take place only in the plant 2 because of its lowest marginal cost. Okay, and we should produce that means uh, in plant 1 we should produce nothing. That means uh, Q1 should be equal to 0. That means profit maximizing uh, value for Q1 should be 0. That means we don't actually use plant 1. It is not feasible because we have another plant one, sorry, plant two, where marginal cost is lower than plant one, okay? I hope I make myself clear in this video. Let me repeat it here. If marginal costs are constant, okay, but different in each uh, plant, uh, production should take place only in the plant with lowest marginal cost, okay? So production, all the production will take place in plant second, Okay, and no production will take place in plant 1. That means the value of Q1, that means production in plant 1 should be equal to 0. Okay, and all the production will take place in plant 2nd. That means the value of Q1 that maximizes profit of the firm is equal to 0. That means we don't need to produce anything in plant 1. Okay, that will give us the maximum profit for the firm. Obviously, he will choose the plant 2nd to maximize his profit. I hope I make myself clear in this video. Thank you.